So, let's take a closer look into our system. CMM Autocal consists of a cabinet which has uh, doors on the front and back side. It has an air conditioning unit on top to make sure that the cabinet's temperature doesn't exceed the 30 degrees Celsius. And it has a height of about 2 meters and a width of about 60 centimeters. Let's open the door and see what we'll find inside. The first thing that we can notice when we open the door is that CMM Autocal has a modular design which makes the maintenance procedure easy and cost effective since each module can be taken out separately for repair, meaning that the whole system doesn't need to be sent out for service. Uh, the first thing that we have here is the mercury analyzer and there are different methods that can be used to measure mercury but we are using the cold vapor atomic fluorescence technique which is developed by GASMET to measure the total mercury in the sample. This measurement technique is very accurate and selective and it can detect really low mercury concentration levels. And I'm also proud to say that our system has the lowest certified range in the world of 0 to 5 micrograms per cubic meter, making the system future-proof for declining emission limits. The next thing that I'm going to show you is what makes the system truly unique compared to other systems in the market. The test gas generator, which enables the automatic atomic mercury adjustments and it also has the special feature that CMM Autocal has, the automatic certified Cal3 validation tool for the automatic uh, quality assurance Cal3 tests. And it also provides the user with immediate pass and fail results. Cal3 validation tool enables the automatic mercury chloride span checks, which are required according to the EN 14181 standard to make sure that the system functions properly. With this special feature, customer saves time and money since outsourced service or external equipment will not be needed for the performance of the quality assurance tests and also for the test gas input. Here we have the pressure regulators for the instrument air and the generated nitrogen in order to adjust the pressures uh, in the right values when necessary. Below here we have the cartridge filters uh, for cleaning the instrument air and here we have the nitrogen generator uh, which is used for diluting the sample. By diluting the sample we are able to lower the concentration of interfering gases and to ensure the most reliable mercury concentration results. Here below we also have the mercury chloride waste bottle, vacuum pump which is used for the CVAF measurement and also uh, the instrument air drying materials to make sure, sure that the instrument air stays dry. The system also consists of a heated dilution probe which is mounted to the stack and also a heated sample line which is especially designed for sampling mercury since mercury is a compound with challenging and unique properties. Heated dilution probe also has a two-stage blowback feature in order to clean its filter and to make sure that no particles will enter the system. And the sample gas is kept in around 180 degrees Celsius all over to the CMM Autocal cabinet. So, let's take a look at the rear side of the cabinet. Here, as we can see, the heated sample line is brought up through the roof inside the cabinet and actually only the heated line's branched parts are coming inside the cabinet. The shorter one is connected to the analyzer from where the sample is sucked and the longer one is connected to the test gas generator. And from here we are feeding the test gases to the probe. So here, uh, behind the test gas generator, we have the mercury chloride bottle, which needs to be filled only once or twice a year. And as you can see here, we have uh, many tubes, because this is where our test gases are produced. As I mentioned, after our test gases are produced, they, we are feeding those 
through that heated line to the probe because in this way we're able to calibrate the whole system. Below the test gas generator we have the connector plate where all the external power, the signals and the gas connections are located. The connector plate also has some input-output uh, interface uh, for receiving and giving signals like for example uh, the measurement results and also the system status information from the CMM Autocal system. All in all, CMM Autocal is a user-friendly and fully automatic system. All it basically requires is power supply and instrument air from the user in order to operate. And as long as you can determine the measuring intervals and measuring times of the parameters, you're able to sleep well knowing that the system does its job. That is all. Thank you very much for watching this video. If you have any questions, you can contact us by sending an email to contact at gasmet.fi and our experts will be more than happy to help you in any questions you might have regarding the CMM Autocal system or the mercury measurement in general. Thank you.